Usually we, everywhere we go, we gotta introduce y'all to a new seafood boil. And this one is called Just Be Claws. It's pretty good. It was deep in there. It was very small. Yeah. The wait was very long. But we're gonna find out what it's like. They had some different foods that we didn't that we didn't see in other places. Like now, they had um, the fries and meat and um, crab meat with aioli cheese. And it's pretty good, really decent. Um, you know, fries is always gonna be fries, but to put it with some crab meat and <laughs> and uh, to put it with some crab meat and some aioli cheese or whatever and lemon it worked out pretty good. So, and it's real crab meat. Yeah, they don't imitation stuff. They just pull apart out of a bag. Really good. I look busted because I am sleepy. We went walking today, y'all. We hit up in the, I can call it the Eiffel Tower. What is it called? The Statue of Liberty. Statue of Liberty. The lines would go up because I had to come back over to New Jersey to get my, um to get my, ad, my, my, my what is it? My car. Debit card. My debit card got ate up in the machine. So we were going to the Statue of Liberty to go up into what the steps or something? What part was that? Uh the pedestal. To go in the pedestal. But the line was so long the line was so long that we decided to just take the steps. How many steps was it there? Hundred and ninety six. Hundred and ninety eight. Mm. Um, 198 steps. I was too old, but she was counting. Thanks to my baby for help pushing me up them steps because I was done, y'all. I was done. 190 steps and them steps. 198. Only thing she was worried about <laughs> was tracking her steps. It was no, not I was tired. I thought because when you heard 198, you like, oh, that ain't nothing. Man, when we got to what? Six, this is like, no, I said 109 left. 108, 109, 106, 100 or something. I said, what? And this lady came out, she said, you can do it, girl. <laughs> uh, thank you for believing in me. <laughs> and they just came out there like inside corner uh, step. <laughs> they, had already, they had already been there for a while. <laughs> they probably better know what hell like, oh, what? So you can do like, it. You can do it. Oh, this tastes real fishy. It looks like it's gonna be real fish because they ain't clean it. No, nah, it ain't because it ain't been cleaned. It's just browned. Mm -hmm. So I don't no, know. just this part tastes real like fishy. So I'm saying this right here. That means they ain't clean it. Good. No. So you gonna find out. She said it tastes fishy. So yeah. we'll see. It tastes like they stuck their hands straight in the ocean. Like, oh, we about to cook this in the and serve it to the people. Want some in the back? No. Oh, my bad, y'all. Boom. And the fries. Crabs. I'll probably put the picture up as the thumbnail, though. So y'all can see how good the fries was before we pour into it. Yeah, we was fire. We, yeah, we was the first one. We, we, we had been eating more of that than we have the. We ate that more than we ate the. Um, well, I have. Yeah. I've been eating that more than just eating the. Um, Cause it's like. Real crab meat. It, it almost like they did the top and really put it on there. So, and I think it was, which, which wasn't bad. I think it was uh, twelve dollars. Twelve dollars for that. So, but that size is is just a nice size. Twelve dollars. It feeds the both of us. So yeah. Good. So we we'll, you, you really get full off just that going on going there and just getting that. Yeah. And by yourself, you be like, all right, that's all right. 
you know, and it's something yeah, grab and go. Yeah, it's B-Y-O-B, so. Ah. Uh, <laughs> No, bring your own bottle. No, the Uber like, driver said it's BYOB. So I was like, bring your own bag. He said, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> we going there like it's, everybody got what's it's, it's big old. It's, it's about. People ain't taking no little quarts of uh, wine. These people got gallons of wine. Mm -hmm. Big bottle, like big bottle, like that at the club or something. I'm like, these people get the. They found the biggest bottle they can find of wine to sit here. And drink. And eat some crabs. And eat some crabs. I'm like, why And crab? it's so small in there. Oh, man. It's like, it ain't no bigger than the living room. It's so small in there. It look like the living room in there. They got six TVs in there. Every TV, my, you might as well every, every, uh, every, um, every little table got his own TV because it's like, you can get more TVs and tables in there. Yeah, they do. <laughs> yeah. So, it's actually, it's okay. If I was to like rate where to go, I would say Baltimore is killing everything. And this one is okay. But I'm really hungry, so I'm not even wasting it. So I'm really hungry. And I'm really tired. We've been walking all day. I can't wait to count my stuff. What we walked? We walked up. We took the, the subway. That was an experience. Y'all, yesterday on the subway, these little kids was fighting. And the little girl done tased the little boy. I was like, I don't know. In the subway, supposed to be selling stuff. They're supposed to be selling some Oreo cookies. The Oreo cookies is on the ground. The little boy's laying down. He get up, start fighting. And I'm like, well... Yeah, you got seven, baby. Yeah. They were just so unprofessional. I mean, they kids, though. But. <laughs> That's unprofessional. <laughs> I'm just saying. They're talking about the kids. They're I'm just saying, like, they sent y'all out there. They must have entrusted y'all to go out there and sell the stuff. Y'all fighting in the subway place. We talking about New York. They are out there hustling. Them, nobody, nobody professional send them out there. She's thinking of some other stuff. I'm, hey, I'm coming down from Louisville. They could have. I thought they were doing some little like neighborhood kids to save the neighbors, or save the neighborhood kids or something. They was down there fighting and tasing each other. And I was like, these little, why do they got a taser? The little girl had a little brain here. She was cussing that little boy out, beating him up. Yeah. It was, some, it was some hood stuff. Just put it like that. Real hood stuff. Real hood stuff. That was some old world star, but I was like, I don't want to pull out my phone because I don't want to get taste. So. We talking about kids, though. We didn't even. They don't matter, though. Yeah, they, these was kids, kids. I'm like, they, they look they, like they will disrespect you in a heartbeat. Yeah. They, really, they don't care nothing about how old you are. I was trying. Like, the only thing I don't like about New York is when they say people here are rude, they are rude. Like, rude. Driving, they don't care about you. They will run you over. They will run you off the road. They will beef at you. They're very rude. Down there, they was just pushing past me like they did not see me walking. If you don't hurry up and get on that train or get a seat, when I do oh, that, man. <laughs> the seats is crazy. You better get on the train and get sit down. <laughs> Cause standing up, and you got random people holding your shoulder. Lean on you. Yeah, mm -hmm. if you want to be racist, go there. Go stand there because you told the toe face to face. You smelling people's breath that you don't even know. Oh, you know. Hey, I want some king crab. Oh, yeah. Oh. Out of a 10, I give this about a 7. I'm giving it about a 5 right now. Yeah. And I'm only giving it a seven because the fries is actually good. That's the only reason I'm giving them a five is because of that. This what mm -hmm. I heard. Seems like it's a little overcooked. And then the dude was all rude. And we've been walking all day. We're trying to sit down. He's going to be like, hey, oh, there's somebody eating going to sit there. I was like, uh, okay. And they come with this big old thing of wine and, and wine glasses. Kicking it. Yeah. Crazy. It's an experience, though. 
Would I come back to New York? No. It's not for me. It's not like... It's not like a place like... I'm 31. Not for 31 me. 18 me? Yeah, it's gonna be popping. Because, like, Madison... Not Madison Square. What's the thing called? Times Square. Times Square is open all night. And I tell you, there's this dude. Yesterday, he was like... Like... He was out on the corner just working out in the mirror. In the corner mirror. Half naked. Half naked. With Half a mask naked. on. Half naked. With a mask on. I thought he was whole naked. We saying half naked because the only thing he didn't see was his penis. It was crazy. Yeah. It was crazy. It, it was he crazy. was working out the 50 cents. What was it? Ghost time. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Thank <laughs> 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 you. Know, but I was like, why is he out here working out? I see why he was working out. Dude was ripped. I was like, he, he's cut up though. I ain't even gonna stun. No, working out. But he's ripped though. Sweating all over the place. And look, now nah, he got his. <laughs> he had his coat still on. <laughs> it was a sight to see. It was. It was because you know how you could drip your coat over your arm to your to your like. Uh, middle of your arm and right there your elbow. So he had his coat still hung on that. Like he just took his coat off. It's like he was ha- it was like he was naked underneath. The- <laughs> he was naked underneath the coat. <laughs> it was like he was naked underneath the coat. But all he did was he dropped it to his arms and then like you know he- he's in front of a storefront that's got like a mirror type of you know tent. He's like yes. You can hear the music going there. Go shorty. It's, it's your, your birthday. birthday. He's like, uh, uh, uh. And then he's... He was making that noise, though. That's the noise he was making doing it, because that's what made me look at him. I was like, what is that? Because he had a mask on his but face. He I didn't have... That? He didn't have dumbbells. It was the elastic bands, though. <laughs> so he had the elastic bands on his, on his feet. He's like, uh, 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 uh. But and he no, had his, so and he had his big old he looked homeless, but he had the <laughs> biggest speaker that I can think of. The speaker you go the roll around on the cart. The roll, ah! the gas on uh that out. Yeah, the, the, the speakers that roll around and got its own wheels to it. So it was it was crazy. Oh, yeah, that's what you don't she don't want to take she don't want to thank it other boy. It's boy. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm out of house too. But yeah, that was funny. So I mean, there's a lot going on in in Times Square. We went to the Brooklyn Bridge. So pretty. Like movies don't do the Brooklyn Bridge injustice. It's so freaking pretty. But they don't play about their lanes on that bridge. So so. It's a bike lane and it's a walk lane. So Herb, it's so many tourists on there. It's crazy. But I don't know. It's like 300,000 people there. It's a lot of people. But, but the, the, the New Yorkers are dry, trying to ride that bike across the bridge. And they just want to go home. I'm like, they just want to go home. <laughs> They're like, why are these people here? I just want, I'm just trying to get to the home. So everybody's coming from. Manhattan over to Brooklyn on the bridge on bikes. And we all in the way taking pictures, taking selfies. And the guy walks up, he's like, He ain't walk up, he rolled up. He rolled up, so he rolls up, he's like, Bye bike, 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 bike lane, bike lane, bike, bike, bike. And I'm like, What? He said, Bike lane, 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 beep, 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 beep. And so they got the little, Bling, 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 bling. And he was like, Just respect the signs, you feel me? Y'all in the way. So somebody was walking past, he was like, he's about to get smacked and by me. I said, okay, I understand it. I thought it was New York Broadway first. I'm about a bike lane. It was funny though. It, yeah, I had to be there. It, it was hilarious. Because they were so serious. like They were serious about these lanes. Yes, they were. He they, didn't tell them that. They didn't People did not. Like, oh, 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 oh. They kept coming through and making yeah. burn sounds. <laughs> I was like, what is going on? You could, you could tell these people were like, like would have thought you knew like dude this is the bike lane get on the other side bike lane going to what 
right, walk the lane, go on the left. There's so many people. You cannot beat. The lane is literally this big. So the lane can only literally hold two people at a time walking. And you got people coming. Probably from, three. Coming from the Manhattan side and even coming from the Brooklyn side. Because right. people was walking from the Brooklyn side. Mm. And you can only walk on one side of the bridge. So it's not like there's two sides. One on this side of the bridge and one on this side of the bridge. There's only one side that you can walk and ride on. To go up and down. To go either to Manhattan or from Manhattan. So, you had the rest of the side of it. So that right there all in itself is like all these people is just I mean they standing on stuff, taking pictures, they sitting down taking pictures, they need the people are driving the cops. So. Yeah. It's just it's just stuff going on everywhere. You got people selling stuff on there, it's stuff everywhere and they want to sit up here and put us all on one side. Bike lane, bike lane, man. No. So we try. It's so cold. I would have loved to go to cold Coney Island, but it's freezing. I would have loved to go to Harlem. We're gonna try to go to Harlem tomorrow. I would have loved to go to Queens, the Bronx. Like New York is so big, it's crazy. Yeah, it's crazy how big this thing is. You just don't feel like you've seen everything. But I really don't want to make another trip up here to see it. So it's kind of like whatever I see now. That's what I see. Anything else you want to say, babe? Um, have fun. Blissful time. Um, you got time to come? Come. Always make time. If you are married, always make time for yourselves. Don't. Don't not enjoy all that life has to offer. Because you're going to work and you're so consumed in your day to day that y'all can't just step back and just be with one another for a little brief second. Like, we didn't start off by going everywhere. We started off by going, like, we live in Louisville, so we started off by going to close. Like, we went to places in Kentucky, 30 minutes, 30 minutes like 30 away, minutes to an hour away. away. And then we went from 30 minutes to an hour away to two to three hours away. From two to three hours away. Then it was like, it got to be our 10 year. And we was like, okay, we've been married for 10 years. We need to do something big to celebrate our decade of being together. Is that the case? Yeah. Our decade of being together. So we found some cheap tickets and just went to the Bahamas. So, I mean, just gradually do it. If y'all ain't got the money, because that would be the excuse the majority of the time is, I don't have any money. Or I don't got nobody to watch my kids, or whatever the case may be. So just start small. And yeah. You gotta take a grandma with you. But we was taking one day. It was like a uh, two days, something like that. Like yeah, we wasn't going that long. We was going like like Friday, I said, thirty minutes away, coming back, hour morning. away. You know what I mean? Like, and we would go there. Like we would go to hotels that was random. Like, I think one year we went to uh, a Holiday Inn that had the jacuzzi room, and the jacuzzi room had. The jacuzzi was shaped like a heart. So we yes. thought that was neat. So we went there. And we ate somewhere close. I think we ate at an Asian restaurant or something. Yeah. Asian buffet. Yeah. And that was it. I mean, it is what it is. 30 minutes away, you can drive your regular car. You ain't got to drive no... You ain't got to go and rent no car. For us, it was just about being together, just spending time together. No. Oh. Yeah. Just being regular people. Mm-hmm. So... Keep it simple. Take a break from being mommy and daddy for an hour. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's what it seems like. But we can't know. stop talking about our kids and we can't stop calling them and checking on them. So. That's basically our muck with your muck bomb. This is like, it's the way you bite into it. It's good, but it don't hold the flavor like which my father said. Probably didn't cut it. Yeah, what you call it? What? Cooking it? Yeah. Like, what is that? Baltimore's, man. I'm I'm sorry. Baltimore is killing. 
Well, I can't even remember what it's called. Cranky Crab, Crafty Crab, whatever. Crafty Crab. Crab the Crab is killing the game. I'm a, I might have to give them another review. Plus, they was faster. We waited 30 minutes for this. Yeah. I like the corn. It just tastes like regular corn. It tastes like a premium water. It's not holding the flavor. But, thank you guys for tuning in. Peace out.